What is up, everybody? Kick a zero six here. Try it out, Apex Legends on the Ryzen 5 8600G. We do have uncapped FPS just to see how high we can get. We have it on the recommended settings by um, Apex. So we're gonna see just how well it does. There's not a lot of, there's not a low, medium, or high that I saw. So we're just gonna do the basics, the defaults, and see just how well this uh, integrated graphics will work. But one thing I will say before we start, make sure that you download the AMD. Let's see, what is, what's that software called? I should know this by now. This is my seventh video. AMD Adrenaline Software, that is what powers your CPU. So you need to make sure that you download that. Otherwise, you're not really going to have a good experience with your, uh, with your, uh, CPU. So, right now on the default settings, looks like we're right around 60. That's not bad yet. Let's jump down, get into some fights, and... Keep it up. Oh, goodness, I thought he was down. Okay, so you can go ahead, and I'm just gonna run around and try to get in some fights, and you guys can take a peek at that FPS, and remember this is the deep, this is the suggested settings by Apex, and we're running at 60 FPS right now, but I will say, actually, let's, let's try this out. If I come into here, there was one of the settings that made it try to stay at 60, so I'm wondering if I can turn this off, because that's might be what's keeping it at 60. Let's turn V-Sync off, and I wish we could turn this guy off. I don't, I don't think we can, though. What if we turn it to 100? Let's see what happens with that. Just to see how well it'll do. Alright. Let's hop back in it and see what happens. So we are getting up to like 80 FPS. But now we're getting back down into the game. So it's going to... Uh, so it's going to fall a little bit. But that's okay. That's expected. Overall, it really doesn't look that bad. I think I'm going to change these settings back because we did sacrifice. We sacrificed quite a bit for, for swapping to there. The, it just does not look as good. So we're going to leave it on how it was because it, it really did change it quite a bit. So we'll, turn, we'll change you back down to 60 because it was trying too hard. So triple buffered, 60. Now we're going to go back into it, and it should look a little bit better. But this video is going to be nice and short. Again, my name is Kika06. Um, this is what I'm doing, just testing these out. I got the Ryzen 7 8700G to uh, test next after a couple more videos of this. I think I've got The Sims I'm going to do, Sons of the Forest I'm going to do. If there's a different game you have in mind that you'd like me to do, feel free to drop it in the comments, and I will probably try to get out of the lobby here. And I will try and uh, get that taken care of and maybe make a video about whatever game you want. As long as it's free or I have it. That's uh, it's kind of my rules. Um, but overall, I'd say this game is actually handling surprisingly well. Very solid at 60 FPS. So pretty close to what... Well, actually the same thing that your uh, PS4 is doing if you're still playing on PS4. All right, we got a kill. But that is going to be probably it for this one. All my links are going to be down below. Uh, there's going to be my Twitch, my Discord, my whole computer build. You go ahead. If you have any questions, ask them. If, uh, if I can answer them, I will. But I hope you guys have a great rest of your night. Thanks for stopping by the channel.